It's having a cup of joe this morning, isn't it? It sure is. I'll probably have to, I'll probably have to look like a pet goose right there after daylight, but right. we'll be all right. I got some of them uh, wet wipes. Them, uh, Good ones. Ooh, ooh. Lord have mercy. Ooh, it's starting early. What you think about this morning? I don't know, boy. <laughs> If you was we got, a, uh, we, got, we got to be on turkeys. We saw the turkeys too late in the day, but we didn't roost. Eight fifteen. So we didn't roost them. So we don't know exactly what words they're gonna be. We need the turkeys to go. Did you want to just pull over right there? Is that a oh, whoa, whoa, we'll keep going. That's a fuck, that's a culvert. Maybe right here, though. <clears throat> the lights off, I can see. All right. It's just a sign, state game land. <clears throat> off the road pretty good, but. How far do you say that is? Forty three to the edge. Mm -hmm. If I could shoot a little thing. Mm -hmm. as long as...
this guy up and do it. He's right on the corner. Mm-hmm. I do think we need to stand up. Because I think we can walk straight to that hedgerow right there without him seeing us. Don't yeah. you? What you want to do? Walk over there and call, call straight to him from as close as we can get. And back back up to here. Make get him to break. <laughs> What's new? Might be able to get her eyes on him too. Might be able watch the turkeys come out into the neighbor's field there and they're going back toward the back corner of the property that we got here and there's a field on this property too in the back corner so we're hustling around there to try to beat them there and hopefully that's the way they are headed If he ain't heading towards that other damn field. What other field? I don't know. It could be. I thought I had him here. He's right there. No doubt about it. I mean, he's still in the field. Huh? He's still in the field. You want to try to move up? He's either going to come down this way. Or like you said, he's gonna come through here. Look like there's a road to go through there, doesn't yeah. it? Then we need to back up and do this. If he comes this way, we can always double back because we know he's coming to good mm -hmm. our side. If he goes that way, he's off our property. Yep. This is scratched to pieces. That's scratched to pieces. That kind of tall grass, so there's a good chance they'll walk to the edge. Hmm. 
They all just started moving left fast, didn't they? They're going left? Mm-hmm. The whole flock just moved left. You want to double back on them? Mm-hmm. shade of these woods and just pick our way out you know you want to try to get that close to the trees there i don't know I can shoot the back one. You ready? Yeah. Did a little yelping. Got him in here a little closer, huh? That's all we had to do. <laughs> when them hens started going, I said, shoot, if we don't, we don't start pounding them. Mm -hmm. But it worked perfect because they coaxed about another 30 yards yep. away. Yep. Thank you. You got it, boy. What a hunt, man. What a hunt. God. Hey, you know what this is dedicated to? Moves and counter moves. <laughs> Can we go out there and get him? Yeah. I know everything kind of went to heck there, it seems like, but maybe not. I mean, we basically was making a loop around the front of these turkeys. They came in on our field, went back into where they were originally and we were kind of gonna move down because we thought they were gonna loop around us and when they started mo looping around us we just looked up and there was a pile of jakes that the turkeys were gobblers were kind of pushing around and when they did all the jakes just suddenly made a break for us but they were gonna cross out there about 60 and I said they're gonna be too far on ain't they been there's an old road bed that comes out of the corner of the uh, other field over here and uh, that's where they were headed to. So we just started yelping at them obnoxiously almost. And it brought them turkeys that wanted to look into this wood line. And it brought these turkeys right here to look in the wood line and uh, we finished it.
Got you fine, Gobble. He is fine, boy. He is fine. Oh, man. What a hunt. What a big old turkey. He is, man. I hate that he flipped over in the what sand, fast. though, you know? Yeah. Dry him off. Lord have mercy. Might have shot him a little low, but <laughs> we got him. God, what a beard on that turkey. Let him dry. I was going to shoot the first turkey because I knew he was the looker, but yeah. I wasn't sure if you want him. Yeah. And, and he slipped saying, through I that gap. I could shoot this one, I could shoot that one, and I was trying to, when you said that, like I was still on him on the right side of the tree, and you said that, and I was trying to get over to the left side of the tree to get on him. Mm -hmm. And... <clears throat> no, anyway. the first one made it through too quick. I was like, dang, I was like, well, I can shoot the back one. I can shoot said, the strutter. He said, I can shoot the back one. I can shoot the back one. He said, you want it? I said, yeah. I thought what it was about to be crawling and just <laughs> getting was gonna be full of day, this yeah. damn black sandy crap they got in these fields. <laughs> they call it dirt. If you're back home, they call that pot and saw or something. <laughs> there ain't no dirt around here. But anyways, I thought it was just about to be a day of just snaking, huh? <clears throat> Yep. Them Jake's out front. We got to helping at him a little on the way down here. And I just looked up. There was two hens off to the right side of them. But I was keeping my eyes on them. And they were not chasing those Jake's. They was pushing that flock of Jake's off. Four Jake's around. God, look how wet his wingtips are from dragging in that wet grass. I oh, know. Is that not crazy? I mean, he's been doing that stuff for... All morning. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> I'd say I get him more than well. At least he's got plenty of beard to spare. Boy, does he? I am. Yeah. I love that stuff, boy. Mm. You were getting a little antsy back there, boy. I can what? tell. You were getting a little antsy. You're like, keep your damn eye on them. I was like, shit, they moved. I, I, I said, I'm going to yelp to them. I want to see the <laughs> response. To see if they're gonna pay us any attention. And I yelping to him and his god was like, all right, what are they doing? I looked down there and you got your hands beside your head. I was like, No, I was <laughs> That's the whole purpose of me calling to him was for you to keep your eyes on them. Let no, I was I, I was watching, but they moved left behind that junk. That junk. So I put my binoculars down. About that time you I, turned, biggest... I said, That's about right. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I I wanted to see what those Jakes were gonna do, because I figured they were pushing them Jakes around all morning. I figured if we could get the Jakes over here. The Jake's broke this way. I don't know if it's because of the calling or not, but I feel like them closing that 30 or 40 yards, we needed them to close. No, oh, that's what did it. Yeah. Whenever we started calling, <clears throat> well, because they stopped right there, and what I'm thinking what happened was when we started kind of pounding them yep. with the yelping and stuff, when those Jake's stopped, these long beards and Jake's over here, I mean, I could see them perfect. They started beeline and dead to us. Dead I said, to us. Boy. Shit, that's why I told you. I said, if, if the suckers the swing route. right, I ain't going to be able to shoot them because yeah. I'm going to blow your eardrums yeah. out. Yeah. You said, you better hold your ears. I said, you better not. You better wait on them suckers <laughs> to get all the way around us if they go right. <laughs> uh, Man, what a hunt. Glad I got to do it with you, old boy. It you was got a it, good boy. one. That was fun, wasn't it? Yeah, we had a good time. We got him in two days, boy. I'm not going to see what them two buzzard heads is doing. Boy, yeah. Larry and Mo? Yeah. I bet them clowns are eating some Twinkies right now. What do you think? <laughs> Have, are they TikToking you right now? A text message or whatever? I don't know. I'll bet they burning you up right now. Man, a bull Jake. <laughs> How about that? A bull Jake. I saw that turkey from like 500 yards. It looked like a Brahma bull standing out there. I said, a bull Jake? What are you talking about? I mean, he's a bull, all right, but shit, he's a gobbler. Come on, sit down here. Come on, King. Sit down. Last time we'll get to do this this spring. You know what? Yeah. Somber feeling, isn't it? But it's not one of those things I've been thinking about it. Like it's part of the process. When you start the season, you know that there's going to be an end of the season. <coughs> when yeah. you start the hunt, you know there's going to be an end of the hunt. And it's like a the outcome couldn't have been any better, but at the same time, you almost hope it comes down to the wire so that you get to hunt as long as you possibly can. Yeah. But like, when you put into motion the game and the game plays out in your favor, you can't like not reap the reward, you know? 
Well, yeah. Could have like, very well just let him walk on past and say no. Yeah, you know. We'll play again tomorrow, but like you, you can't do that. Uh uh-uh. uh. It ain't in my in my my genes to do that. It's <laughs> not in my blood. You know what I mean? I mean you can't. We almost let him walk by too. Because I was looking at the yardage, I well just but with my naked eyes. Well, like, we were in the woods like, about 25 yards. That's what that's what me throws up. you. Yeah. Off, because I was looking out through there, I thought, oh, he's too far. And then I got to looking at the actual size of the turkey, and I thought, <clears throat> he's closer than I think he is. Oh, yeah. You know, you're usually on the field edge, so you're looking across nothing but field. Yeah. But I said, hey, how about that second one? You on him? <laughs> yeah, I'm on him. Pow! <laughs> I didn't hesitate with that one. Hey, because r- believe it or not, another three or four more steps, and he was behind them bushes. I couldn't have been stuff. able to shoot him, yeah. I don't know, man. You want it to... It's like you come out here. You don't get out of bed with any other intention. Like you're out here to win the game. Well, we came out... at the same time, I was like, you know, we could play this game here with this tag until the 7th. Oh, man. It'd be nice to... But you just can't... You can't start the game with intentions on not finishing it. I know. And... When he walked across the front of us, I was like, just like yesterday. I mean, yesterday, you know. Uh, I mean, yesterday, you, you almost want to duel, but you're like, you know, the turkey flies down in front of us. He gobbles over our heads. He gobbles at the call, standing in front of us at 40. Like, what do you want him to do, kill himself? You know what I mean? you got to shoot him, boy. You and I still about him. screwed that up. But. It happens. It won't be the last time you'd be scratching your head yep. about that, so. Yep, yep. And like Rafiki told Simba in the Lion King movie, I told you this before, when they were walking across that meadow and Simba was, you know, he was boohooing about his dad passing and stuff, and Rafiki took that stick with them two coconuts or whatever <laughs> on it, and pow, boy, slammed him across the head. Simba said, ah, why you did that? I said, don't worry about that, son. It's in the past now. You know? So, I don't ever look at stuff in the past too much. But how about we enjoy some of these... Fine. You done brought some. Is that the fusion ones? That's the grape. Oh, you got grape ones. Yeah, they didn't have the fusions at the store, but mm. grape will do. From Jacksonville, Florida, made in the Dominican Republic. The sale is only allowed in the United States. I'm glad it was in this little town in Michigan, that's for sure. You gonna smoke you one of these? I guess I'm gonna have one more on the season. But this is just it's just like this the shot this morning, the shot yesterday. It's one of those things where like I look forward to it. But at the same time. I know. You know? Well we'll smoke this one slow. How about that lighter? Mmm. You know, me and you started the season together, not that we hunted a whole hell of a lot. I wish we could have got to hunt mm-hmm. a lot more together, but we started the season, the season together and we smoked one of these in Mississippi mm-hmm. when Sleazy killed his turkey. Well, Sleazy slipped up on one, huh? Because I had them, grape he had ones. the peaches. And you had the grape ones. And I had the grape ones, I gave you a grape one. Mm-hmm. So we started on the grape and we're going to end on grape. Oh, we do. Well, I'm, I'm an equal opportunity cigar smoker. As long as a dead gobbler hanging. Yep. So. That's the only time it, I smoke them nowadays. So. Grape it shall be. I bet you used to hit them back in the elementary days, didn't you? What? Cigars. Uh, no, not in elementary, but boy, when I got to like, right there in college, boy. Whew. We're burning them up. Was you? Oh yeah, for the wrong reasons, too. I thought y'all boys in Louisiana started that stuff in the elementary, about fourth grade or so. I don't know, we were still in, we were still in Bud Wise's in fifth, sixth grade, though. Well, boys. Man. I, I almost don't want to light this thing. I don't either. I really don't. Got well, a lot of work ahead of us. Got a lot of work to do. Pile of footage. Bunch of content coming out there. Oh, well, you got to fool with all that. I ain't got to fool with all that. <laughs> I got to look forward to a lot of work to make up for all the time I missed during turkey season. Uh, and build, start building the funds for next year. Yeah, that's really what I'm looking forward to. I guess that's the only plus of this, because I don't I'm not one of those guys go jump on a big skeeter bass boat and say, Oh man, let's go 
<laughs> How they say it? Let's go rip some lips. <laughs> nah, I ain't going to rip no lips, Pod. Nah, I ain't about all that. <laughs> well, we can sit here and reminisce on the season probably till dark, but let's get to smoking these cigars. What do you think? Yep. You ready to you ready to put fire to the last one of the season? I guess. I think I'm gonna have to. Say, I might send this one to old Tanner Burns and get him to mount this one. Oh, well, are you going to get him mount this cigar? Yeah, mount that the last end of that cigar with that gobble I'm gonna send him. Yeah. It's gonna write a little 2021 20, on it. Yeah, something. It's just sad that it's over, but. Mm. Yep, don't put it out. Oh, she's got fresh, fresh in an apple. She'll run. You know, when me and you first hunted together, the two years ago? I guess you can say two. Yeah, two years ago. In Mississippi, I have not killed a gobbler since then that I haven't sat, sat down by a tree and smoked a cigar with him. <laughs> I haven't. And I'm sure glad you <clears throat> you steered me that direction because, you know, I was kind of one of those, just sit with him for a little while and... Pick up and roll. Always sit with him, you know. I never just pick him up and roll. But... I don't know, it's just something a little different. He's a hammer for the last one of 2021. He is a hammer. You know what? Hook spurred turkey. Yep. I think they know. got a fox squirrel over there shaking that tree. See him? You can put him in a brown grave, ain't you? I'd like to kill him and when we go back to Alabama, I'd cook y'all um, some, some of that landing gear and some limb bacon. That'd be choice. See him over there? I see him. Okay. He done about broke that limb he's done on this fat, ain't he? Yeah, them squirrels over here are big, but I mean, shit, so much agriculture, you know? Mm -hmm. We saw a squirrel out there grazing like a deer out in the middle of the cornfield, didn't we? Yeah, that was a black squirrel, too. Yeah. <clears throat> you talking about the one yesterday? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's tasty. It is.